what I should do. I mean, I tried pretty much everything to get Naruto to understand that I really love him. But nothing seems to have worked. I tried giving him letters. Those don't even seem to reach him half the time. Then I tried telling him in person. But then I always seem to faint. Why does Shinobi in mind to faint every single time I see my boyfriend? And then on Valentine's Day, I tried making him cookies. And that didn't work because he wasn't even home. There's got to be something I can do. Wait, Easter's coming up, right? What if I lay out Easter eggs for Naruto to find? And I make a path straight to me? And then maybe inside those Easter eggs, I could have candy or... Wait, no, you know what's better? Coupons to Ichiraku Ramen. Ramen is Naruto's favorite food. So if I put all those coupons in there and Naruto comes straight to me... Maybe, oh yeah, Naruto would ask me out on a date, and we'll have dinner together, and maybe then when the moment's right, I could tell him over dinner. That'd be perfect. Oh, wait a minute. I don't even have Easter eggs. Where am I supposed to find those? Father doesn't keep them around the house anymore. Hmm. Oh, I know, the local supermarket must have them. So, I'll go to the market. I'll pick up some Easter eggs and then I'll go over to Ichiraku Ramen and pretty much beg them for coupons. And then, oh, this would be perfect. Alright, so I'll be right back, you guys. Wish me luck. Things couldn't be more perfect right now. I mean, I got everything I was looking for. I got the Easter eggs, and I even got the coupons to Ichiraku Ramen. Those guys are really so nice. I don't see how any of this could possibly fail. I mean, it's foolproof. And if Naruto doesn't get that I like him after today, I don't know what else will help. <sighs> Here we go. I just hope Naruto finds his way here. I mean, this is an easy mission. I mean, even an academy student can figure this one out. Okay, I guess all I have to do is wait, right? Orochimaru! Ah, I hate that guy. Ah, oh, and Tamari. Tamari's so cool. I mean, she swings around that big fan. She's one of the coolest Konoichi ever. so long. <sighs> I hope nothing really happened to him. Hmm. Naruto really is taking a long time. Maybe something did happen to him. Maybe I should go find out what happened. Nanta-kun! I just found out what happened to Naruto-kun, and I really don't believe this. Shizune told me a couple of minutes ago that Lady Tsunami sent him on another mission. Can you believe this? Every single time I want to do something with him, he ends up being dragged off somewhere. The first time was with Master Jiraiya, and then on Valentine's Day, Lady Tsunami gave him that mission just to get him out of the village for a while. And now today, I heard that Naruto heard rumors that Sasuke-kun was nearby and went up to Tsunami and demanded to be given a mission to go looking for him. I'm really sorry to think that Naruto-kun likes Sasuke-kun more than he likes me. I mean, every single time Sasuke-kun is even mentioned, Naruto goes half-caught deciding he wants to go looking for him. But that's not even the worst of it. When Naruto came back to the village, he didn't even get those Easter eggs. They ended up being taken by someone else. And this is what really happened to him. I can't believe how many Easter eggs I got this year. I mean, I got so much more than I did last year. And these are really cool. 
I mean, some have money, some have candy, and some have these cool tickets from Ichiraku Ramen. I mean, I love their ramen. It's some of the best around. Kaya-chan, I'm coming in. Okay, the empty Easter eggs led right to Kaiko's house, but I don't... Oh, hi, Aniko-chan. Hinata, what are you doing here? Are you looking for my mom or something? Wait a minute, where'd you get those Easter eggs? These Easter eggs? Well, I found some in my house and in the backyard. Then I found some around the academy. And strangely enough, I found some around the Hugo compound. Found them. Wait a minute, those are the ones I left for Naruto! These eggs were left by my mom for me to find. Oh, so you thought those were the ones that your mother left you? I, uh... Oh, I'm really sorry, Hinata. I really didn't know that you were giving them to Naruto. So, I, uh, I mean, I'm really sorry, Anago-chan. Excuse me. Wait, Hinata! So the Easter eggs ended up being at the Uchiha compound. I felt really guilty yelling at Anago-chan like that. I mean, she was just doing what every other normal little girl does on Easter. They collect Easter eggs. So once again, I failed to tell Naruto how I really feel about him. And I'm really starting to think that it's a nearly impossible mission. I mean, I've tried pretty much everything and he still doesn't get it. Maybe the only way for me to tell Naruto that I really love him is if I protect him in a battle in the near future against a really powerful enemy. Maybe then he'll get the idea. Or maybe I should start listening to everyone else who keeps saying that Naruto can just won't get it no matter how many times you try to tell him. It's really starting to make sense now. But I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up yet. I'm going to keep on trying until Naruto knows. Even if it kills me. Which I hope it doesn't. Because I don't want to die before Naruto finds out. So if you guys have any ideas that could help me tell Naruto how I really feel about him, I'd love to hear it. Until then, I guess I'll see you guys later. Bye!